In the night before, Joseph Gordon-Levitt is orphaned when he's 19. Both his parents die and his best friends, played by Seth Rogen and Anthony Mackie, vow to be his family from now onwards and to take him out for fun on Christmas Eve. It becomes a tradition and in this movie, it's the last time they're going to do it. It's years and years later. Seth Rogen is about to settle down and have a baby. Anthony Mackie is too famous. He's a successful American football player. So this is their last big night on the tiles in New York City at Christmas. Now, we've all sat in pubs with people when you're sober and they're really, really drunk. And watching Seth Rogen take an absolute bucket full of drugs in this movie, coke, grass, pills, and watching the effects on him is really, really not entertaining and not funny. It's quite painful to watch at times. The other two aren't much better either. And this kind of movie, well, I have some residual affection for Seth Rogen because I love Knocked Up and I was very fond of Superbad as well. But struggling to face up with being an adult when you're in your 20s can be charming. But when you're struggling to face up with it when you're in your mid-30s, well, I just wanted to reach through the screen and give them all a bit of a slap.